Might help. Yeah, can we get a couple of jumps on it? Sorry, guys. You gotta put that back. Alright? So many people think what I do is disrespectful. Wow. That was... Sorry, guys. Uh, take care, guys. I really hate hurting a lot. And I do my best not to. I love proving that you don't need a $4,000 bike to do a job. I had to put this thing on the front of a city bike. It sucked. It's gonna be a, it's a calculated maneuver here. I think like four years ago, my homie was like, I'm gonna make a page dedicated to the dumb shit you do on these city bikes. And then I was like, if you do that, I'll go hit LES double set tomorrow morning, which was like Thanksgiving day. <laughs> right before the whole crew started cooking, I was just like, wait, we gotta run and do one little thing. That's how it started. I look back at that and like, you couldn't pay me yeah. to do that right now. Yeah, yeah. No amount. How old were you? That know? was four years ago. So I was like, I know that was probably five years ago. So I was like 28. Okay. Maybe 27, I forget. I just, I yelled because I was fucking scared. Yeah. These are all my personal city bike tees. This is the one with the with the kind of like, there's the twin towers on it. It's like a New York City tourist tee. Mm -hmm. And this is, this one here is like the, uh, this is a uh, Grateful Dead kind of a uh, funny vibe. What's, what's over here? Oh, this is my little shrine here. The 145th Street Gap. I knew how wide it was. I measured across. I also measured how fast I could get going. But as soon as that train passed, like I was already waiting and I just went. As I was getting ready to take off, I was like, I got this. I could see the landing and everything. And I took off and was just like, oh, like, oh, this is so far. Like anybody that's ever filmed with me, just be rolling. Because if I start thinking about something, it's not gonna happen that day. When I got across, I was more mind blown than anybody that happened. I remember what I was wearing that day. Like, I was wearing the Peels hoodie and um, the black pants with the stud belt and and uh, half cap. So like, I remember that fit. I wore that fit for like three days after. Yeah, I was uh, I was on a different type of high that that week. I have been skating for 15 years now. And when I get on a bike, I do something I couldn't do on a skateboard. I'll be riding as long as I possibly can. But two years ago, I was probably more of like a go crazy, go fast, jump big, be gnarly. And now I'm just at a time where I want to be more technical, more finesse, more creative and having a lot of fun at the same time. That's pretty fucking sick. <laughs> so it's like a little less risky, but I think more enjoyable to watch. I love hopping on that bike and doing what you can with it.